Is this game good on PS5 or wait for PC? It's fine on PS5. I mean, granted, it doesn't have the greatest frame rate of any other, uh, of like any fighting game ever. I'm sorry, any game ever. But it is, it runs fine. It runs fine. This is arguably one of the best looking games ever, period. Like, FF16 visually uh, is, look at this fucking canyon, dude. Look at the fucking canyon. It could be better. And don't get me wrong. It could run at a higher resolution. It could run at a higher frame rate. But does it really, like, ruin the game? Now that you can turn the motion blur off, I don't think so. I think this game is very good looking. If you if it means, like, between buying it now and you have a PS5 already and waiting, like, a year plus, I mean, you do you, man. But I don't know if the experience is going to change that much. It would be a lot better with a, a more consistent frame rate, especially in the field. I this agree, man. This used to be a trade route for merchants crossing the scars. Till the Republic laid a new road wide enough to let wagons pass. Okay. And all official traffic moved there. Leaving this one for those living outside the law. Indeed. I doubt we'll be the only outlaws on the trail today. Oh, we're above the fishing village. Damn. Oh, I heard that. That water is doing a lot for... The environmental art design here. Jeez. Ride bird? Hell no! I can ride a bird here? Nah! I don't even want to. You stay. Ambrosia. You stay. We got 2,000 points to work with. I'm about to get myself more limit break. Oh. Whoa. Hmm. I haven't used wind up at all. I want to start using some different abilities. You know? I need to take off uh I wanna I wanna use different abilities. I wanna take off uh, this. Lightning rod. Get rid of it. I like the fact that we have wicked wheel, that's fun. Will of the Wikes is fun. Heat wave, I'm taking off. Um we're gonna have no magic counter. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's do, uh, something we haven't done very much of. Let's do Scarlet Cyclone. Yeah, we have not seen that barely at all. We've seen Gouge, we've seen Rook's Gambit, we got Wicked Wheel. Uh, I should buy, like, a crazy level 3, maybe? Maybe Garo does ult? I don't know. You can combo Wicked Wheel into Upheaval, by the way, instead of jumping manually. Really? It's a nice combo. Got Thunderstorm over here. Seemed like it might be pretty good. Yeah, let's do Thunderstorm. <laughs> oh, I have to master it. Like a bitch. Yo, Jeff Gag, thanks for the prime, dude. Mission, Scarlet Cyclone.
Dang it. Damn, the upgrade on that. It's crazy expensive. I'll master this. Oh, that's fine. Have some fun. Do some different shit. Yo, RC, thanks for the prime. So what do you think? That we'd be lucky to... Do I know you guys? Really? It's as bad as that. Oh, why? There's trouble up ahead. And too much of it for us to handle. I take it there's danger on the road. Oh, what about this fearsome looking fellow? You think he'd be equal to the task? Oh, no doubt. Assuming he's willing to hear us out. Well met, friend. My brother and I have My been bruv. tasked with finding a merchant's missing cart. You seen it by any chance? How does a merchant misplace his cart? Oh, the man's a coward. Yo, Yuko and Codex, all the primes of today, or the subs today. Thank you, everybody. He had abandoned in the pass. He sent the two of us to fetch it, but it's gone. Now, I'm not much of a thinker. I know the work of thieves on my yeah. right on all account. We may have yeah. seen our share of action. You, yeah. however, have the look of a man who needn't fear a band of backwater ruffians. Chances are they'll come for you either way. Yeah. But if I'll you... help you. Yeah. Well, if I'm going to get on with it. Anyway. Yeah. You clearly got a fine head on though. We're yeah. Lucky you came along. Now, yeah. Hoping to make a heavy purse in Bocklad. Our merchant friend loaded his cart with as much as it yeah. he won't be forking over the right. Yeah, I'm sure. Just a, nope, nope. You just put yeah. him into those bandits and I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow the green thing and then fight the thing that shows up at the green thing. That's what I'm gonna do. Um here is a criticism. I have spent a lot of time listening to side quest dialogue, and only some of it is good. I'll have to sure wait till the side quest too. engages me in a way that makes it worth to hear out the dialogue. I should probably take care of them. Because at some point, I'm like, God damn, man, you are slowing this fucking game down. Come on. Let's go. Holy Why shit. You no Guests. These must be our bandits. <laughs> Ow, you fucking ass slammed me. Did it again. Ow, he did it again. I can't see shit. Can't see shit, Captain. Get me out of here. There's a lot of effects going on there. Damn, uh, Marchin Canader, the Northian, thank you for the gift subs. Uh, Danger, thanks for the five gift subs. Holy hell. Pancho, Mosey, Big Panda Boy, uh, Pogar. Thanks, everybody. Holy shit. A lot of people all of a sudden. That's them dealt with. No. Where's that card? Keek. How do you make the stream look so good? Are you using capture card with the PS5? Ah! Ha ha! Yeah, well, I mean, yes, I am, but ah, no, no, no. I'm not gonna answer that. You're trying to bait me. I'm not answering that. Shut up, you. I've seen your name around here. Plenty enough, Savage, to know that you're pandering. No pandering, okay? I can't have 
We can't be in sub mode and people are like, hey, how does the stream look so good? What's going on? No, no, no. Uh, hey, 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 hey. Don't get me started. Thank you, though. Thank you. This out of here will be a nightmare. Seems we found... Found the cart and didn't leave a single bastard breathing. Our merchant friend will be delighted. He will exactly be. How will he be getting his goods out of here? You leave that to us. After all, it'd be wrong to make such a fine warrior haul cabbages to market. You've done your part. And that's all you need to worry about. Here. It's been a pleasure. Now piss off. There's no need to be so rude, brother. Cypher, thank you. What if we want his help again next time? Why are they being, why are they being suspect, huh? Why are these guys sus as AF? What's going on here? What's wrong with them? I don't trust you. I see the Dalmex lag behind Rosaria when it comes to bridge building. The fallen ruin should hold at least. The path continues on the other side. Interesting area. That was a side quest, yes. Yes. I'm seeing the resolution issue here. Hold on a second. Might be better for graphics mode. Oh, a little bit. Uh-oh. Oh, I targeted the other one somehow. Yeah, I look forward to the day we eventually get AV1. I definitely do. I don't know if it'll be coming anytime soon, but for sure. Yo, Beacon, thanks for the 19 months. Cool. Look at this place. So this is the Mechas. The land of the gods. It's even more impressive than I imagined. I remember being captivated by the story as a child. Long, long ago, man was overcome by avarice and challenged the gods in a bid to win their power. The final battle took place. Damn, Arrow never sleeps. Thanks for the ten gift subs. Fault. Holy shit. Thank so you. Goes. If anyone ever manages to plumb those depths, perhaps we'll learn if there's any truth to the tale. That the gods emerged victorious and punished man for his defiance by visiting upon him two curses. Dominance in Paris. To tell the truth, I always thought it strange that the dominant and their icons were deemed a curse. Back home, the dominant inherited the throne. They were admired and exalted, not spurned. Whenever I got to that part of the story, I always assumed there must be something I'd misunderstood. 
You had a lot of storybooks, didn't you? In your room, I mean. When we were young. The old legends were always my favorites. Epic battles between gods and men. Father encouraged me to read as much as I could. He thought it good for my education. You really were a boy like any other, weren't you? Just look at this place. It's enough to make you believe the legends are true. I know. We're not far from Boklad. The road will be busier up ahead. And we'll have to keep our wits about us. <laughs> Something wrong? Nothing. It's nothing. Hmm. Hmm. Meanwhile. I see the reports are true, Father. You have surrendered the throne to Olivier. I have. Emperor Olivier shall rebuild the Holy Empire of Sambre. How is he to rule an empire? He is but a boy. I shall advise him until he comes of age. Father, please. Or for as long as I am able. The empire we seek to build needs young blood to rule. And I can think of none better suited to the task. There is other news, Dion. Hugo Kupka is dead and Drake's Fang destroyed. The pillars of the Republic have fallen. Ere long, the Imperial banner shall fly over every city in storm. And then, Valisthea. All shall bow before their Emperor. Father, these are the words of a tyrant. They are the words of a god. The Emperor whom I gladly serve. Great Grieka made flesh. Turn to your camp, Dion, and ready your forces. It is time to show the world the true power of Sambrek. Father. <laughs> I find you much changed. Is this truly the path you wish to tread? Or are these the ambitions of another? Of Ultima, perhaps? What nonsense is this? I speak my mind, and my mind only. Though I do owe Annabella thanks for reminding me of certain truths. Regarding the nature of nation, of rulers, and of the divine. You would trust the words of this traitress. She betrayed her country. She slew her husband. You have ever been an invaluable servant to Sambrek, Prince Dion. 
I trust you will continue to serve your Emperor in the wars to come. The canker! Silence! Insolent wretch! You will bend the knee. All else is heresy. Sire, forgive me. This audience is over. Come, your radiance. The Rowena Syndicate awaits your pleasure. Oh, not another meeting with silly old men. They're so boring. I'm hungry, Father. Can't we have luncheon instead? Does it pain you that you will not inherit your father's throne? I have suffered worse. <laughs> Count your blessings, Dion. For a baseborn child to be chosen by Bahamut is miracle enough. You have risen high on his wings, but you shall rise no higher, lest your impure blood stain the throne. What do you know of my blood? Where is this going, huh? She's the worst. <laughs> She's just the worst. Captain Suitman, Super Mario. Swagada uh, Swagadaya, thank you for the prime. The Meanwhile, we're back. To the north. We just need to hug the coast. Look at this game. Holy shit. This is an environment. Can I jump down this? Ah! Yeah, I can. Check that shit out. Dynamic. Look what I can do. Look what I can do. I'd love to play the final Ultimaniac difficulty if, you know, I could ever beat this game. His radiance has lost one I'd love to play it. We can be sure Sylvester will do everything in his power to hold on to Twinside. This game will ever end. Well -trained and increasingly it doesn't end. But it's not as if we can wait for the siege to end. What? These abilities are fun together, right? They're pretty fun together. These just hang out around me for a while now? Cool. Yeah, mixing all the abilities together is really fun. Just seeing what works, what complements each other. Boy, editing for 
to the Crystalline Dominion too, are you? Yes. There's good guild to be made there. Believe you me. Yeah. I have plenty of money, thank you. When I heard them bandits have blown up Drake's fang, I packed up my store and pulled me boots on. And so did you, eh? Well, yes, you eh? What? Watching. Some baths down by the Dalamil Inn. How can anybody sit back and relax in a land that ain't got a whiff of the crystal's blessing no more? Yeah, I agree. And that's what it me. If you're looking for lucre, the Dominion's the place to be. Soon enough, half a storm will be headed there. Yeah, me too. If I can get in first and set up shop, I'll have a license to mint Gill. The Gill Masters of Canberra will be beggars by comparison. I'm sure they will. I'll be famous in all four quarters of storm soon enough. I'll have a fortune that'll make me mom and pa proud. Yep, they will be. Okay, we're good. We're we're clear. Clear. Holy shit. Yeah! Dang it, doesn't work. That's the shortest one. What? Yo, Red Naughty, Fizzy Pop. Thank you, everybody. Gooper Sandwich, great name. Thank you. Hoodie, thanks for the nine months. Give me a chicken so that guy doesn't talk to me again. I'm too fast to talk to you. I'm sorry. No much further to Jeez. And they're all making for the crystalline dominion. Because they don't know how to live without the crystal's blessing. All right. I don't need to fight those guys. Wait. Is that an item over here? Was it worth it? I mean, I guess maybe. Hard to tell. Hey, you brought a chicken in here. What about mine? There are no Rats. Here. We have to keep going. The crystalline dominion is our only chance. This is where we're supposed to meet Goots, isn't it? That's right. He said he went for us here after replenishing his supplies. But These towns definitely look great. I will give them that. These towns look real nice. What do you think, girl? Let me carry your goods. I'm cheap. What do you have? Well met. Mine is better. Jeez, that's why I got so many new potions now. Holy shit. A fine choice. You've a got so many potions up. now, my god. Bloody crimson scooping. Leave some for the rest of us. Just looking around at this place. I guess I'll go to MSQ. It'll probably have us talking to a whole bunch of people very soon. What a pretty game. from across the water come one come all feast your eyes good sir can i interest you in uh, uh, none how much for a measly crust of bread you won't find any cheaper not nowadays they are more than welcome to look shit current world financial crisis very relevant
The Empire's unlawful and illegitimate occupation of the Crystalline Dominion is still in effect. Only those whose business in Twinside has been officially approved by the Republican Army will be permitted to cross the border. All who seek entry are a former line and ready their documents for inspection. It looks like we aren't the only ones who are eager to leave. And they're checking everyone. Can't you make an exception? Not for the likes of you. We won't get through without that pass. Let's go and find good, shall we? Oh god, it's the TSA. The whole god. It must be around here somewhere. Sweet as nectar. Hey! I'll take the large one. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, good. There you are. Clive, I, I'm so sorry. Don't tell Nan, will you? Slow down, Goot. Just tell us what happened. It's me trader's pass. It's gone. We cannot ride the caravan without it. We won't even be able to get through the flipping checkpoint. Do you remember when you last saw it? It was in me pocket a minute ago. But then a burn bumped into me and... Here. You don't think that they might have nicked it, do you? Do you? Don't surprise me. A busy market like this is prime territory for pickpockets. So, to get the pass back, we need to find this child. Where would we even start? <gasps> I, I know where! I, I've got a pal in Bocklad who might be able to help us. No one knows more about what goes on round here than she does. Where do we find her? She's the owner of the Crimson Caravans, up that way. Sound's got a red chocobo on it. No time like the present. You two go on ahead. I'm gonna check the rest of my stuff, make sure no one else is missing. Right. We'll meet you there. Let's keep an eye out for this red chocobo then. And the other on our purses. It's a good town. I like it. That's some great little scenic points to it. Not a lot you can do here. Most of these beats NPCs are bears, just chilling, beans. selling beets and beans. It'd be nice if I could buy those and they do something. Like, you almost, it, like, it's weird. Do we want systems in games like this where you could run around and pick every Fern, Barry, and Larry, you know, and they'll do something, they'll allow you to cook something, they'll allow you to do this, allow you to do that. Do you want that? Like, you know, like you can kind of do in like Horizon or like even Metal Gear 5 kind of stuff? Do you want that stuff? Or is it just, is it just bloat filling like, like Zelda and shit like that? Like Tears of the Kingdom does it with their cooking system, right? The interaction is fun. I agree. It is, it is fun, but there needs to be like something with it. Yeah, in Witcher games, they do a lot of that kind of stuff, right? I mean, of the little bit I played of the Witcher games. Chocobo. Looking to hire a coach? It's 10 million for a two-birder to the Crystalline Dominion. Take it or leave it. Oh, we're not here for that. Then I bid you good day. Oh, wait! Just don't go, Elle! He's been made! As I live and breathe... Goots! What are you doing back in Boklad? <laughs> I gather Lady Karen didn't send you. Yeah, Yakuza games let you eat in restaurants and shit. I see. I did like the uh, the cooking aspect of 15. I will so give it that. Trouble have you got yourself into this I thought time. that shit was fun. Uh, it's me trader's pass. It got stolen. By little Ben. Of all the... You're you know, the cooking and mobile. fishing was fun in 15. Honestly. Ugh. Goots told us that you know the markets well. Might you have an idea which little Ben could have done this? We don't intend to punish them. We just need our pass back. Ben? We can be on our way. I see. So neither of you has a trader's pass either. <laughs> 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 
Not that anyone would take you for traitors. But I suppose that's why you came to me, correct? Now, I can't say for sure who took your pass, but I suspect I know why they did it. Let me explain. Ever since the Fist marched on the Dominion, the Republic has been clamping down on any commerce that might aid the Empire more than it does us. Which means traders' passes have gone from being merely a way of easing one's progress to being essential if one wishes to cross the border at all. And with demand outstripping supply, they've become a precious commodity, leading some to seek to acquire them by less than legitimate means. So the children are stealing passes to sell on the black market? Yes, and no. Passes are inscribed with the names of their owners, and yet none of the victims' names have appeared on the register of those passing through the checkpoint. We need a business license, oh god. That someone is doctoring the stolen passes. The same someone who is encouraging the children to steal them. And the same someone who has Goots's pass, no doubt. Whoever they are, they're ruining the livelihoods of honest merchants, which is why we've decided to take a stand. Will you stand with us? You want to get your pass back? And yes. we want to ensure that no more are stolen. Catch whoever's behind it all, and two birds shall be slain with a single stone. Is there any other way of getting to the Crystalline Dominion goods? They won't let you in if you're not with the caravan. It's that, uh, I don't know, try swimming across the strait. But, but the guards will definitely spot you if you try and do that. Like, uh, we don't want to get spotted, right? So either we find the people who took the pass, or give up all hope of entering the Dominion. All right. We'll help. Thank you kindly. Um... Yeah, but I don't know your name. Eloise at your service. Clive. A pleasure doing business with you, Clive. Hey, another badge of honor. The proprietor of the furniture makers by the coach stop is spearheading the search. Wear that, and he will know you for a friend. I suggest that you speak with him first. WMLK, the thanks for the prime. Understood. Out of my sight. Wretch. Eddie Killer, thanks for the 6 months, dude. Jug of snake spit for the road. The caravan stops next to the checkpoint. Are you the furniture maker? Looking for something in particular? Ah, and a wee's collared you too, eh? Then I expect you want to know more. She told me you were leading the hunt for the pickpockets. What have you learned? For one, that they're targeting the traders carrying the biggest packs. Harder to watch your back, see? And less chance of the mark giving chase if they're spotted. This is probably going to be Not children that, that like stole everything, them. but I can't fight Those children, so... Every inch of this warren like the backs of their hands. Can they be like demons? Their eyes must have lit up when they saw pocketing demons? The fishmonger round by the gate's been trying to track down the children involved. Dang it. You should go and have a Still children. Thank you. Probably not gonna let me fight children. You won't find anything of this quality in Twinside. You should come with me to the Dominion. Fish for sale! For Can I interest you? Ah, sorry. Message from Eloise, is it? She's asked me to help her. To help you. Is that so? Suppose I better tell you what I know then. For one, this isn't a family operation. All the traders say the children who stole their passes were dirty. 
dressed in rags. Street urchins, by the sound of it. We get a lot around here. Orphans from the wars. A few, perhaps. You saw the refugees gathered by the entranceway? They're all looking for a new start in the Dominion and beyond. Some of them take it as an opportunity to rid themselves of unwanted baggage. The shame of it. Whoever's behind this would have to have made themselves known to the children at some point. And so should we. Should... It's worth a try. Oh shit. Sorry. All right then. Question shitty people are shitty. Then. Game is dark. How hard can that be? Taste my peaches! They're sweet and bitter. Excuse me. Do you mind if I ask you something? I can't stop you. I was just wondering if anyone has asked you to do anything out of the ordinary recently. <sighs> anything you grown-ups ever ask us to do is shut up and go away. So guess what I'm about to tell you? Sorry. I'll leave you alone. So guess what I'm about to tell you? <laughs> Take them down. come to me. Do you have a moment? What do you want? What I want is to know who's asking children like you to pick pockets. I don't know. Nobody's asked me. What's picking pockets? Do you get paid for it? No, uh, you get in trouble for it. So if they come calling, you know what to tell them. I'm going to talk to Excuse every me. child on this continent. What do you want? I, I, I don't have any money. It's all right. We're not going to hurt you. We just want to talk. What, what, what about? We've heard that some very bad people are making children like you steal from travelers. We need to know who's behind it so we... I don't know much about it, really. But my friend, Honza, he... He said he got a job doing something dangerous. Sounds promising. We need to find him and ask. Do you know where your friend might be? He's usually by the tent outside town. E. Hansa? Even. Edmund Hansa? Come on, come on! Peaches and pears. Let me carry your goods. I'm cheap. Yeah, I still think, like, one of the ways to sort of maximize the interaction in areas is that like certain towns and regions and locations would give you like the refugee camp. glamour like armor for that area Daddy. and allow you to like customize your visuals or your look you know and the only way you can do it is to max out the the fame or notoriety in that area giving <laughs> that you the ability to get some cool picking. looking stuff he wouldn't have noticed if we robbed his boots off him <laughs> yeah Wish we hadn't handed over the pass, though. Could use one of those things to get out of this dump. Chance would be a fine thing. The moment they found out, they'd string us up by our guts. Would they now? Perhaps you'd like to introduce us to these charming characters. Shit! We're in trouble now! What do we do? You two get caught if you want. I'm off. Hunter, where are you going? Scallywag. So that was Hansa, eh? Jill, you watch these two. I'm going after him. All right. Clive straight throws his sword at him. He can't have gone far. I need to find him before his employers do. That's that then. Did you see a boy run past? There was a boy ran back there towards the chocobo pen. Thank you. Found your child. Time to die. Shit. Cornered. It's all right, Honza. I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to ask you some questions. <sighs> Fine. Not like I've got a choice. I'm looking for the people who are making you steal for them. Who are they? 
call themselves the Carl Stones. They said they'd give me good gill if I did what they told me. I knew they were bad, but it doesn't come for free. Didn't come at all half the time, before I started buzzing for them. You know, if I didn't do it, they'd just pick on someone else. Someone they could push around easier. Hunter. You found him then? Jill. Where are the other two? We ate them. Eloise is watching over them. She sent Goots and I to look for you. <laughs> you him! I haven't got your pass anymore, if that's what you're after. I gave it to the car stones. Whatever you do to me, I can't get it back. Not that I go against them anyway. If it weren't for their gill, me and my mates would have starved. Force another child to do your bidding. Wait, we're not. Don't hurt him. You're making a mistake. We're on the same side. Like hell we are. That brooch. Where did you get it? <laughs> Master Theo. <laughs> Goots. What are you doing with these people? Unless you're the ones my sister was talking about. Your sister? Eloise didn't tell us she had a brother. And why would she? I'm just her back and a blade. Theodore, at your service. Sorry about before. Theodore, what do you know of the cast stones? Vultures who have made Boklad their hunting ground. They prey on the desperate, stealing from those with Gil and bullying those without it into joining their flock. I'd been looking into their activities in hope of sparing the refugees any further hardship. But it seems they've already stooped even lower than I'd feared. Hans is a good lad. Don't blame him for what they've made him do. If he and his friends hadn't agreed to work for the stones, some other poor souls would have. On pain of death, most likely. Clive, was it? And my sisters asked you to help put an end to the pickpocketing. Then we all want the same thing. Quest complete, but not accomplished? Huh? Oh. Move three feet, talk to a guy. So, what's the plan? What else? We find the cast stones, and we crush them. You get your traders passed back, and I make Boglad a safe place again. All right, then. All right, then. All right, then. Honza, where are they camped? Don't worry. They'll never know you told us. Couldn't if I wanted to. They always come to town to collect the passes. Meet us outside the gate. I tried following them once, but they spotted me halfway down the trail. Said they'd string me up. We'll try it this time. Which way were they going? Back down the road towards Leighton's Cleft. To Leighton's Cleft, then? Laney's cleft is to the south, past the camp. Yeah, let me go explore this area out here and see what's going on. Daddy, there are no crystals here. I will say, uh, for like an action game and a Final Fantasy, uh two genres if not they share a similarity their main characters usually have very goofy running animations i'm gonna give it i'm gonna give final fantasy 16 a very high credit and something that has been difficult to accomplish in games for the past like 10 to 20 years clive's run cycle is pretty good in this game right his jogging 
walking and fast sprinting run cycle looks good because in most games they look fucking weird like they try to give the character too much personality or some shit and they got some goofy ass run oh hi how's it going that's the one who's been sticking his nose in our business you should have minded your own That guy's still alive? I doubt these are the ringleaders, but at least we know we're on the right track. Ignore these things around me. running and bump one of these guys with my chicken oh man Sucks to be that guy. Get him. He's left alive. Thank you, puppy. Thank you, Poppy. Big boy. <laughs> Not a bad haul today, eh? Aye. Some of our new recruits are natural born ne'er do wells. Especially the little ones. That Hans has got nimble fingers, all right. <laughs> It'll be a shame when they chop them off. But till then, let's make the most of it. Scum. The leaders of the cast stones, I take it. They don't deserve any mercy, Clive. I wasn't planning on showing them any. We're ready when you are, Theodore. Oh, I'm ready. Fuck! Thank God from Falkland! Kill him! Kill them all! Yeah. Oh, you big shitter! Oh, oh, I was on the wrong icon. Ugh. Shit. King Willie, thank you. Miss me. Damn. 
guy was getting. This guy had a lot more life than I was ready for. Thank you, King Willie, for the 10 gift subs, and thank you, Savage, for grabbing a hoodie. Appreciate it, dude. He was hella thick. You got Jill over here casting, like, Balenciaga 4 on his ass. And they say crime doesn't pay. Gold chains, rings, purses. Ah, and traitors' passes. Dozens of them. Have the names been changed? Not yet. I recognize some of them. No doubt Gootz's is somewhere among them. Now I just need to sort through it all and return everything to the people it was taken from. We should go and give Eloise the good news. Can we leave things here in your hands, Theodore? Of course. Oh, and, uh... Be sure to tell her of the part I played, won't you? We'll be glad to. No loading. Hell yes. Ah, Clive. How goes the hunt? My brother isn't getting in your way, I trust? Quite the opposite. So it was the cast <laughs> stones who were Thank you, King Willie. Theo told me he'd been on their trail. And their demise solves three problems at a stroke. That of the pickpockets, the bandits pulling their strings, and the passes they were stealing. I only hope yours is among the items you recovered. Only time and Theo's return will tell. Speaking of whom, welcome home, dear brother. You are too kind, Eloise. Here, Clive. Goods is past. Ask him to keep a closer eye on it from now on, would you? I will. Thank you. El, I've asked our boys to carry the rest of the goods back. Can I count on your help in sorting through it all? Of course. I'll make some space in the storeroom. I expect you'll soon be on your way then. But it wouldn't do to leave without introducing yourself properly. Would it now? Sid. Don't look so shocked. We're on the same side. I don't understand. As you now know all too well, we at the Crimson Caravans are always happy to help those in need. For a small fee, we will move anything that needs moving. Be that goods to market, or bearers away from it. Or a piano. I was the first my sister helped escape. If it wasn't for her, I'd have been branded as a boy. I had no idea. It just so happens that we are seeking to expand our operation. And who better to join forces with than the leader in the field? Wouldn't you agree, Theo? I would. It seems our purpose is the same in more ways than one. So what would you say to working together again? Yeah, sure. It would be our pleasure. And our honor. The honor is ours. Here, Clive. This is for you. Eight dollars. Oh, that also is good. What is it? Elle has friends in high places while I have associates in uh, lower ones. That mark is proof that you're a friend to us both. Hmm, more seals. Yes, good. I They're stacked on top of each other now. Well, all that remains is to wish you a safe... There definitely needs to be a fan art of a goofy-ass looking Clive with just a ton of badges caravan. and patches as all over his ass. Difficulties, we would be he's just, like, to covered to brim with them, and he's got this, like, stoic, like, Jesus. Of course. Say... Nine million? We'll... Try the caravan. It definitely has to exist already, right?
Thunderstorm cooldown. Nice. Right Two there. seconds. It seems so little. Let's get this back to goods. And then it's on to the Dominion. Ooh, a bunch of quests. Uh, you know what? I think I'm gonna leave a few of these. I think I'm gonna leave a few of these and then just continue MSQ for a little bit, and have come back to them for like a big side questin. What I really want to be. Here you are, good. Try not to lose it again. Me pass. You found it. Oh, thank you so much. Nan would have killed me if I'd come back without it. I'll have to say thanks to Ellen, Theo too. So should you, Hunter. Yeah, that's my only issue is that some of these like really break up the anymore. pacing sometimes. If anyone threatens you again, you know who to turn to. We do. And we already have. Miss O's given us a job shifting the chocobo shit out of the stables. It's hard work, and the pay isn't half what we got from the stones. But if we stick at it, we'll keep ourselves fit. <laughs> you stick at it, then. And Goots, I'm sorry for stealing your pass. Uh, that's all right. I've got it back now. Uh, and all's well that ends well, eh? You said you're trained to be a blacksmith, right? Well, I'm going to be your first customer. I'm going to save up all my gear and get you to make me a massive sword. I'll do me best. <laughs> <laughs> Till then, eh? All right. We have a place on the wagon. Remember, Goots, we're mercenaries. You hide us to protect you. But mercenaries. <laughs> and you remember the plan? You're to ride all the way to Twinside. Jill and I will go with you as far as the outskirts, then find our own way in. I'll buy that stuff I need. Right. And we'll scout out the Imperials' defenses. There's a square with a big bell tower right in the middle of town. If you get lost, or out goes wrong, we can meet up there. All right. Let's go. Exactly, Bojack. <laughs> I see. And you're quite certain your father has no knowledge of Ultima? I am. I have no difficulty believing a sinister force has come to exert an influence on Sambrek. But be that as it may, it is yet to claim my father. For better or worse, his radiance speaks his own mind. Then the fiend works from the shadows. I confess, when first you told me of this fiend, I had my doubts, and more than a few at that. A beast that labors to plunge Valisthea into turmoil, all in pursuit of your brother. But that wound is proof enough that evil is afoot. Then I have your answer, your highness. You will join me in my fight. I cannot. Not yet. Your highness, please. As you are aware, the Dalmechian army is at our gates. They have lost their mother crystal, and with it all hope of a negotiated withdrawal. It is but a matter of time before they invade. Muhammad is not here to meet them. My people will be slaughtered. Though not by Hugo Kupka, thanks to Ultima's machinations. I 
know the fate of your people weighs heavy on your conscience. But if we do not put an end to Ultima's plans, they shall face a far darker fate. The chaos he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. The lives of every man, woman, and child in the Twins are at stake. I believe what you say, Phoenix. But I have duties of my own, and I must discharge them. Come what may. My blood. I know that it is wholly unworthy of the highest offices of state, which rightly belong to those of purer breeding. Alas. Your bloodline runs through the Oriflam gutter, from a whore who weighed her child's worth in gill. Have you threatened my father? Of course not. I merely whispered in his ear that his mongrel son is plotting a rebellion. What? Sylvester listens to the words of his astrologers. And they have ears too. You have been feeding them your lies! Should you remain loyal to Emperor Olivier, his radiance may yet crown your head with laurel. And not with tar. Fork-tongued witch! <laughs> In consideration of your long years of service to the Empire, I shall forgive this uncharacteristic rudeness. Now hurry and make ready, your Imperial Highness. Emperor Olivier expects much of you, Dion. Or should I say, of Bahamut. May your fire reduce his enemies to ash. Till all of Valisthea bows to its rightful ruler. There is another darkness that has taken hold of Sandbrack. And until its grip is released, the flames of war shall spread ever wider, just as Ultima wishes. Forgive me. My family has caused you much grief. You are not her keeper, Phoenix. This is a matter for the Imperial household now, and as a member of that household, it falls to me to resolve it. At such time as that is done, what strength I have shall be yours. Ding, ding, ding. No, Dion's a good guy, yeah. Thank you, Your Highness. Mm. Let yeah, this is like allegiances, but a new dawn to he's not a complete piece of shit. I should like nothing more. Terence. My prince. Tell me true. Do you believe what I'm about to do is wrong? I... We Dragoons have but one leader, Your Highness. And we shall follow him unto the very end. Thank you. This is my decree. For their crimes against the Crown, the traitorous Annabella and her usurping son shall be put to death and the Empire restored. Whoa. 
Whoa, they're planning a coup. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me go use the restroom really fast, chat. I'll be right back. I lied, chat. I also got a snack. I lied directly to your face. We're all kind of meeting in this place at the same time. One would never guess that these people stood on the brink of war. When they're afraid. They turn to drink to forget their fears. Anything you want to forget? The harbor is empty, and half the market stores too. The city may seem peaceful on the surface, but it's balanced on a knife edge. Were we to give it a nudge, it might be just the distraction we need to reach the Mother Crystal. I thought you might say that. We should send for Gav. We'll need someone to keep the fires we start from going out. And we can busy ourselves scheming until he gets here. I'll send a stolas then. Is that a crazy bird? I think the stolas was like the nutty owl, the laser owl. What is it, boy? <sighs> That's one hell of a distraction. Say it's Vogel. Phoenix. Dang. This way. Handel, yeah, all right. What in the hell is going on? Let's go and see. Right. But first, we find goods. Just hope he's all right. 
Oh shit, hi guys, how's it going? Goods. I see you, shithead. Well, they're all dead. Oh, hi, big boy. Ow, I can't see shit, Captain. Get it in time. Oh, I did. It just didn't work. Okay. Boy's dead. They're dragoons. What is this then? A civil war. Let me just have to happen to have very good timing. Jesus, I thought this was like a chasm. Never thought I'd be glad to fall into a sewer. That's a huge fucking crab, bro. Mega lore crab? Mega low crab? Mega lore crab? Whoa. What of the men and women in the market did? The evacuation is complete Good. And all that remains is thrown the protest Whoa. There it is. The bell tower. Right. Let's go. I'm currently being engaged by the video game and its premise. Get out of here, bird. Ah, a 
goods left. It's a good thing Joe got up here. Hey man, what's shooting at me? Actual dragons? You piece of shit. Come on, you didn't get him? Then that guy survived that. Very good. Holy shit. But you die, you crazy dragon. I think I have a lot of life on it, damn. Negative? Oh, there's a stairway right here. It's so goddamn dark. Secret over there? Whoa. Peace 
piece of shit and juggle me. Not bad. Where's the other guy? Oh god, I'm just trying to deal with the ads. Oh, you mother. No shield? Oh god, no shield. Missed it, shit. Oh, wrong one. Shit, my bad. Did he interrupt me? Yeah, Will of the Wisp and Lightning Rod at, at the same time are very good. But you die. Gill bonus. Give us something big to fight. Anywhere? Huge dragon, come on. How do I know? Oh, 
the wrong button. Yoink. Shit, Captain. I didn't get it in time, didn't get it. Stop, stop, stop doing that shit. I'm trying to kill you here. Holy shit, ass.
Enough. God damn! God damn! That poor dragon. That poor dragon. Oh. Good for something. Gonna make something out of that, that's for sure. Yeah, Raging Fist is great. Uh, over here, Clive! Uh, he's alright! <laughs> Goats, there you are. I didn't know there'd be a dragon. <sighs> alright. Let's get out of here. Oh. What now? Is that Mother Crystal's heart? What the hell is it doing up there? What the hell is happening? Something's happened. Forgive me, Yud, but I must put a stop to this. Your Grace! Crystal's all fighting back and shit. Some wild and shit happening now. do now then we destroy the heart we might come back as soon as the flames die down the Imperials and the Dalmex will move in this may be our only chance and Bahamut has gone for now you should get as far away as you can Goots what a new view slot in the ledge I can't do that if you're staying then so am I. I. I packed everything up before I made a run for it, so if there's out you need, just ask. But I won't be giving it away for free. Nan would never forgive us if I did. Thank you, good.
Gootses, what? What can I do for you? Welcome to Gootses Toll. <laughs> Damn, this diamond sword looks fucking awesome. Oh my god. Holy shit. Looks like some it looks like the goddamn paladin sword from 14, bro. Looks like paladin AF. I mean, not like AF isn't as fuck, but uh, you know, AF is an AF. Shut up, chat. Ooh, diamond armlets. Damn, goods, you've been holding Thank out. You. Is there how else you need? Yeah, I want this fucking sword, bruh. I don't even care if it's worse. I don't. Here you go. I want to equip it, too. How else I can do for you? A big hammer. Uh, yeah, upgrade it. Finished! Yeah. I think. Did I just make a second one? Fucking shit. Whatever. Did I just create two? God damn it. That's ten times better than it was before. Give us a shout if you need out else. Okay. Sword's kind of cool. Torgo, what do you have to say? You be brave now, boy. Ork. Drake's tail is right there, Clive. It's time to free Storm from the Crystal's curse. Yes. Oh, it's past time. But remember, Bahamut is still out there. And I dare say we'll be seeing him again before the night is done. There we go. No more roads. We'll have to find our own path. Do you feel that, Clive? Ether. Damn, this place got just fucked need, up. Another flood. It's already turned them. And there's no reason to hold back. <laughs> Jill, they're all dead. Give me a second. What the hell am I looking at? Captain. Oh, 
should be focusing on the other guy. Game. Little bit of overkill. But you know what? Don't worry about it. He is dead and he's never coming back. summon myself, you know? stuff can't tell where to go so many places to go up here If 
about you coming to me. God, it stunned me. Come here, you piece of shit. Big boy down. Onward. Oof. Let's miss that. He'll be all right, Clive. He's a survivor. We're getting close. Some Tell ultimate shit. Neither do I. No, 
No. No. Wrong one. Let's go. Let's go. I'm hitting buttons today, boys. Jeez. Hitting buttons today. I'm gonna open up a window. It's getting hot in here. God damn. All right. All right. These beasts, they're getting stronger. We can think about them later. Right now, there's only one thing we need to focus on. The heart. Okay. That was one hell of a jump. We might be able to get up through the building. It's worth a try. You can hear Phoenix fighting above. Quiet. There's someone up there. Is someone there? Mother. It's you. What happened here? He he tried to take him from me. Oh my boy. My darling. Darling boy. <laughs> Is this the child you made with the Emperor? Why? 
Mother, why did you betray us all? You have no right! <gasps> Answer him. Just stab her. We took you in, savage. Show some respect for those who raised you. <gasps> Honorable Elwyn, always thinking of his precious homeland. But what worth is a homeland in a world beset by the blight? Father did not seek to protect his country. He sought to protect his people. A leader's duty is not to protect his people. It is to protect the source of this sovereignty. The noble blood that runs in his family's veins. So long as this bloodline remains... Kill open, her! What does it matter if a nation falls? Shoot her! Another. Unlike him, I did my duty. I preserved my life. I bore a son of Shoot a her. to whom the whole world might kneel. That is why I gave Rosaria to Sambrek, that I might join my line with the Lasages and birth a savior of this benighted land, blessed by both Bahamut and the Phoenix. You sold your country for a child. Why did he need another? You had Joshua. I had nothing. You were always your father's son, so very strong and bold and daring. And yet you failed to awaken. Would that Joshua had been granted a tenth of your strength. Oh! How the nobles laughed that Elwyn's firstborn was surely the son of a concubine, and my own, not long for this world. The shame of it. The shame of being slandered by one's inferiors. How could you ever know how that feels? It should have been you! Why didn't the Phoenix choose you? She was every waking moment was spent trying to shoulder the burden that you and the Phoenix and the Duchy foisted on him. That's why I became his shield. To help bear the weight. But what did you do? You betrayed your own blood and surrendered your son to his fate! Kill her! Joshua. My darling boy. I never meant to hurt him. The soldier's orders were clear. He was to be spared. Why did you survive when the only one I truly cared for died? What? Have you not looked out of the window? Joshua is here. The Phoenix lives on. He's battling Bahamut as we speak. I looked out the fucking window, you daft bitch. This chick really is the worst. Uh oh. Joshua, wake up. <laughs> I'm a shield of Rosaria. And I will do my duty. What are you... <laughs> It's on.
won all these. You've learned Spirit Flare? What? I've learned Spirit Flare. R2 and Triangle to release a massive stream of light, sears through anything, and aim it. The extended exposure of Flare will cause enemies to become partially staggered. Canceling initiated abilities, maintaining the flare for the maximum duration. Wow. Okay. Sick, dude. I'm just gonna get fucked up by this.
Are we gonna put Joshua? Oh shit. Yep. Uh, move, fire, charge, fireball, evade. Use L when holding circle to lock onto multiple targets. Cool. All ability, yeah, okay. Oh, Panzer Dragoon, let's go! Dev team like kinds of dragoon. I love it. So cool. sequence is pretty goddamn fun too.
we get him? Oh, he not get it. It's now or never, Joshua. Whoa, whoa. Mortal coil, oh shit. So sick. Dead. Oh, we're teaming up? Oh, this is so sick.
so cool. The victory music. Big chunk of levels. How is it still alive? Huh? Or is it not? It's still alive! straight fuse with Phoenix? Of course. God. Embodying Ifrit Risen. Uh, in addition to Wildfire, Risen Ifrit can gain the ability Light Speed, which similar to Phoenix Shift allows them to swiftly approach the target. Okay. How can we hope to match such power? By trusting in our own. Oh my god, damn. Lord.
Jeez, this is so crazy. into Phoenix now. This does a lot. For the stagger, there we go. Refuses to end. Zeta Flit, what the shit is happening? Not today. Come on, Joshua.
is some very Advent Children shit right here. Against the same, it's almost a reference, right? <laughs> oh shit, it's literally like almost a reference directly to Advent Children. Wow. The power of the PlayStation 5. And there we go. There's the music. Good god damn. Ha, ah, okay. He literally was the crystal. Wonder what happened, what made him go like all rogue and insane. One got blown up in space. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're alive. We both are. Nothing else matters. I never dared hope that I would see this day. How is he still alive? How are you still just standing there? Oh. This is for my father. Oh my god, the child was Ultima. to leave. No. Wait. I owe him a debt. Fine. Oh, 
That's right, I do that. Can nothing be done to call them off? I regret not, Your Radiance. The Dragoons answer to none but His Imperial Highness. The Council is powerless to intervene. Madness is this, Theon. Focus all efforts on extinguishing the fires around the capital. The city can wait. What about yes, this is not the word. Daddy, man, go! Your radiance. Are the doors locked? I want you to find out. Make sure the doors are locked. Next move. By the light. Dion. Have you taken leave of your senses? Call off the dragoons at once. Fear not. Seeing what happens. The populace will come to no harm at their hands. I am here to save you, Father. Save me? A creeping darkness hides in the heart of Sanbrek. It stems from your wife, the traitorous Annabella. <laughs> not another word, Dion. Father, though you may not see it, the darkness has taken hold of you. It has made you forget yourself. But I bid you remember, there was a time when you ruled not with cruelty, but with compassion. Why now do you turn your back on your people? Why now do you seek to stoke the fires of war? You too have borne witness to this change, your eminences. And you know, as well as I, who is responsible for it. A puppet now sits upon the throne, but cut his strings, and the master loses the power! What? Dion, you bear steel before your emperor? Guards! Take him! For every citizen who falls, another can be bred. For every home that burns, another can be built. Those were your words. But when the last of your citizens has fallen, and all of their homes have been reduced to ash, what will become of your empire, of its rulers, of your god? As the mother crystals crumble one by one, and the blight sweeps in to claim all that we hold dear. Our people look to their emperor for protection. Yet he labors not to secure their futures, but to seize what is left of the twins for himself. Even if it should come at the cost of everything his loyal citizens have labored to build. Dion, you must understand. A small price to pay, is it not? You've been blessed with great power, Dion. Enough to win me the world. So go, claim Valestia for me, brother. And that's why he freaks out. Gods! Gods! Father. Poor father. How he doted on his children. That he would die to protect me was plain. It was but a matter of when. You... And this. 
You did well to endure so long. But you broke in the end, as I knew you would. And now Muthos approaches. Put him to the proof. I would see if he breaks. Go, Bahamut. Kinslayer. Now it makes sense. Not again. Brother? It's a long story. It's a long story. <laughs> you cannot stay here, mother. Come. Take my hand. No. No, don't, 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 don't do that. Just crush her. Get away from me! This is all just a dream, just a bad dream! You will not take me, Shadow! You will not take me! God damn. A lot of shit went down today. Is that's it for sure. Consciousness that weaves your wills together. Consciousness that blurs the boundary between your own will and that of others. Then we shall set you apart once more. The ties that bind you shall be severed, and humanity return to its proper place. By primogenesis shall a new age of reason begin. Dude's just straight Relax, Advent Children Sephiroth. Your Majesty. What? What? Don't you want to play? It's been a long time. If. That is your wish. Men, you are as meek as all the others. Such feeble creatures. Gifted the power of icons. Yet slaves to fickle emotions which usher you to your doom. And so you bind your fragile worlds 
with strands of consciousness. The wretched handiwork of a wretched people. The sons of fire were united at last, and for but a moment, their flame burned bright. Soon, Muthos shall become our perfect vessel. And then shall the world be remade. Not before the bonds are severed, of trust, of respect, of love. Only when every strand of consciousness is cut away, may Muthos return to our side. By primogenesis shall all be undone. Mankind shall be rid of his wretchedness and Muthos of his will. But while he yet clings to it, he has the power to forge bonds anew. And so we bid you. Find Muthos and sever everyone. To destroy that which has no physical form. You ask the impossible. There is nothing your black blade cannot cut, Odin. We shall unite with Muthos and bring forth a new world. So long as our vessel remains unclaimed by humanity. It shall be done, Master. My will is yours. Guys, really the Emperor. Okay. Okay. All right. How is your brother? Asleep, since I returned from the Dominion. Taya says he should be back on his feet soon enough. For a while, at least. She discovered something on his chest. A swelling, circled in stone. For every mountain we climb, another arises up to greet us, doesn't it? It's never ending. Jesus, D Hoop, thank you so much, dude. God damn. Thank you very much. Even the sky seems to have grown tired of it all. Clive has uh, claimed a portion of the Bahamut essence. 
uh, allows him to have access to several new iconic abilities, such as Impulse, which creates multiple spheres of light that pursue a target, dealing continuous damage. Whoa. Use Bahamut's iconic wings of light to begin casting Mega Flare. Powerful spell that showers enemies with a deluge of searing light. The longer the spell is charged, the more powerful the results. Circle to cast the spell when ready. Wow. Tony won't be happy if I disturb Joshua. While he rests, I might as well see what Otto has to say. Jesus. Word of twin side is that there's little left of the capital after the prince, uh, prince's tantrum. What did you and yours? Did you manage an escape before the city went up? Uh, I trust you did, but a stolas might be good to set L's mind. Reports from our brothers and sisters afield are all the same. These accursed skies cast not only a pal over the land, but over the hearts of our people. Hearts already heavy from the fall of the Dominion and the destruction of Storm's final mutter crystal. For now, the realm endures, but with each new flood do her few remaining children descend further into madness. The situation is dire. Fresh wings shall find you on the new moon's turning. Until then, our witch continues. Just you find your party gain dominion without further event. Should your travels or bring you back to the markets, but you in need of an additional assistance, you'll find the Crimson Caravan. Uh, so please, your lordship, we can both forget about the whole damn thing. This Sid chose to follow them all these years ago is gone. There's no dragging him back from the depths of whatever hell he's talked his way into, but his legacy lives on. You know, everyone here in the hideaway, sure, as the sky is blue, at least. That's still blue. And as long as it is, I'll be right here. Maybe it's not anymore. Jesus, man. Wow. Do you see the pair that got hauled into time? Ah, it's a dangerous world out there. Let's stock up what you can. Coin purse weighing you down. I got that diamond sword. Jeez, man. Finished, are you? What we got here? Trouble with your gear, or... What do you want? The bright burn. Uh oh, I'll take it. No scratches, right? Don't get to use these swords very often, but you know, new new sword look cool. Damn, Drake Slayer's bracelets. Did last you a good while. Uh. Yeah, we can't upgrade that. What does this look like? God. Damn, now that is a sword. Holy free holy, that is a sword. I got some new other shit too, obviously icon abilities. Um, dude, there's still space for like two fucking more. What the hell? Uh, like, don't answer that, but what the holy hell? Satellite. Summon multiple light aspect familiars that attack. Wow, cool. You have, like, drones. Uh, Jesus Christ. Cool. It's gonna be a lot of zoner stuff, right? Begin casting Mega Flare. Circle to execute. This looks funny. <laughs> Eat this, you shitty goblins. Eat this. Um, I think I'm gonna have to start spending some of my cash on big supers, you know? I think it might just be nice to have big supers every once in a while. Yeah, I get it. The Bahamut ability, you have to, uh, essentially hover around and avoid attacks while building up, you know, for a big destructive thing. Um... Hmm. We'll mess around with it. Don't worry. Dodge will fill it faster, yeah. Cool. Did you see that? Tell 
me you saw that. Who are you guys seeing? What? What are you making them skies then? The low one is what? We should call back the scouts. All of them. Hmm. Otto. No one's feeling good. How fares the realm? The realm? Oh, she's just fine. As long as you look past the fact storms out mother crystals and her skies are a roiling cesspit. And Gav? He's with your uncle in the free cities, helping Mid with her project. Setting an owl their way the moment the winds turn foul. Still waiting on a reply, though. Do you have any good news? Well, that depends on your definition of good. <laughs> All right, fine. What do you suggest we do? Oh, no, I'm just the messenger. I'll leave the scheme into those more suited to the task. Could be that Lady Vivian and Old Tomes have their own thoughts on the current state of things. Could be that they don't. It certainly can't hurt to ask. I suppose not. Oh, we got some shit. That guy looks scary. That guy looks scary. Another S rank hunt. Oh, shit. Another one, huh? Good. Good. Very good. Got a bunch of people we gotta talk to. Hold on a second. Damn, man. You know what? I, I will say, uh, the stuff leading up to the, the Dominion, you know, the Bahamut fight, is a little weak. And it, it, it definitely felt like this is a very slow part of the game. You know? What happens in between the Titan fight and the Bahamut fight. It, the, it makes up for it because it's really, like, grandiose and crazy. But granted, it's made up for the fact that right now we had a world event change. Right? An actual big world event change. Something is going on. Let me guess. You're here about the skies. Yes. Is there anything you don't know, Lawsman? <laughs> it doesn't take a court astrologer to argue the obvious. As for what has disturbed the heavens, that, I believe, is a question the Fallen might be better placed to answer than I. And on the sixth day, did the gods tear the sun from the firmament, visiting darkness upon their prideful sons and daughters? But I dare say you remember your childhood lessons on the sins of Zemeckis only too well. You think they're connected? That Ultima was one of the gods responsible? Well, he has certainly exhibited powers that we mortals would associate with the divine. There is nothing divine about him. <sighs> but he wouldn't be the first god of whom that could be said, now would he? Yet for all the fairy tales that tell of the sins, there is almost nothing in the way of actual historical accounts. Had I the journal of Moss the Chronicler, I may have been able to tell you more, but alas, I fear all remaining copies have been lost to time. Hmm. You will forgive me, I hope? Certainly not. Because there is nothing to forgive. Even without this journal, you've provided us ample wisdom. And we will always be grateful for it. Yeah, it's like, it's funny, it, it, you get these, these parts in between, which sometimes they're pretty good, in between the big set piece events. Sometimes they are pretty good, and then, you know, other times you get what, what just happened in the game, which was kind of like, you know, and then you get this crazy invading the Empire and fighting all these dudes and doing all this stuff, and it's like, god damn, this game's awesome, like, holy. It felt like at the beginning of the game, like the first quarter, it was... It was like when, when quote unquote, sorry if this is a spoiler, when Sid was alive, it's a lot of that leading up to that, you know? 
uh and it's like after you become sid it sort of takes like a, a back seat to you like accomplishing things for everybody and all this kind of stuff right it feels like the mo most of the game when when you are sid and he is uh, when sid is alive it's really paced crazy well and then it kind of slows down a bit when you become you know when you become big boss Is it that every one of your little excursions presages some inexplicable catastrophe? <laughs> Sorry. Not that you are to blame for the Dominion's fate. No one could have predicted the actions of the Crown Prince. I'm sorry I couldn't save your home. My countrymen are stronger than you think. A few toppled clock towers won't break their spirits. They'll be back on their feet in no time. I hope so. Look at us. Bluer than a pair of bog crabs. Tempting though it may be, sulking will not help us find a solution to this mess. You believe there's one to be found? I don't know. But I am certain we're more likely to find it if we first examine the facts. Oh god, how much is the blight spread? Beneath these darkened skies. Fear and confusion reign over Valisthea. Oh, the lands around the fallen Mother Crystals had already begun to wilt for want of ether. But not like this. Crystals that filled wells and fueled furnaces. Now nothing but pretty shards of rock. And those that hang from the people's necks cast nary a glimmer of light to keep the dark at bay. It is only a matter of time before the common folk convince themselves that the end of days is upon us. Yet I fear a swift end is more than we can hope for. While most of the world thirsts for ether, the remainder drowns in it, spawning Akashic in droves. And amidst the hordes of mindless beasts, with magics as like to fail as function, even the strongest nation would falter. Rosaria and the Iron Kingdom teeter on the brink of collapse, while the tragedy in Twinside has all but paralyzed the Holy Empire. Dalmechia fares little better. Rumor has it the ministers fled the capital after the fall of Drake's Fang, leaving their beloved Republic to crumble. Walud, meanwhile, moves in earnest. The Einherjar has been sighted off storm. The world, in short, is in chaos. It would seem our civilization was nothing but a castle of sand. To be washed away at the whim of the waves. Not looking good right now. A castle of sand. Not my best flourish, but it seemed fitting. The reports I've received are considerably more blunt in their appraisal. Without the protection of their nations, it will fall to the people to defend themselves against those who would take what is theirs. Which is only ever going to end one way. Defending a farmhouse against a band of chocobo thieves is one thing, but pitchforks and palisades will do little to stall an army's advance. Should the King of Wulu deign to invade, there would be none to stop him. Hmm. None but us. Perhaps Otto will be more inclined to share his thoughts when he hears what the others had to say. Clive, we have a problem. Oh dear. Only one. That would be a first. It would. Actually, there are three. Oh good. We had as many owls arrive while you were at the shelves. Martha's got a Akashic at her gates, and talk of monsters roaming the hills outside of Northreach has put the wind up Isabel and her lot. And don't forget Dalimil. Lubor says the village was raided by bandits. When it rains, it fucking pours. The curse breakers are spread thin, taking stock of the damage in the Dominion. And even if I could get word to all of them, I doubt they'd get here in time to make any real difference. Which means... You gotta fight some crazy-ass Akashic enemies and shit. Then. Jill and I. Let them know we're on our way. 
Cool. Yeah, we gotta start doing taking care of shit now. We gotta start fixing these problems. Yeah, I kinda like it. Does this net me anything better here? Your benefactors are a generous lot. Not yet. Damn, we only have one more left to go. But... Best of luck out there, Sid. Yeah, the, the geo stigma is really starting to get to everywhere. So we're going to send Breck again. Damn, we got to clear up out everywhere. Oh, shit. Every place is fucked up. Oh, yeah, Martha's Rest, yeah. Interesting. Okay. So those Bach Lab missions. Wonder how this um, changes stuff. I do. I'm kind of curious. There was a lot of FF7 references. I mean, in, 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 I'm just going to call it right now the Bahamut like fight and what happens after. It, it was pretty much an Advent Children reference. The way Cloud takes out Bahamut and Advent Children was like the exact same sequence that Clive takes out Bahamut. I was like, wow. And then it it literally is Ultima, like like Sephiroth afterwards showing up after the fight, summoning like the clouds and shit like Sephiroth does. I was like, wow, okay. This is this feels very FF7 slash it feels Advent Children-y. Okay, it's just there. Uh, I'm about to pay attention to these friggin' things. So I'm assuming that one of these each are in each area. Domekia, Rosaria, and definitely Sembrek. Uh, definitely is in Sembrek. I'm assuming this is probably going to be near the, the fucked up capital or some shit like that. I am assuming. I want to go look. Let's go to Martha's Rest really fast. I want to see what's going on in Rosaria. Don't say anything, Chad. Don't answer that. You know how it works. Don't answer that. You know how it works. Shit. The Akashic attacked us out of the blue. And there's no telling when they might be back. You best keep that sword handy, Sid. This man's gonna die if we don't get him to a healer. But all our beds are deep. Jeez. Martha. It's good to see you. And you, Clive. Jill? Otto said you've been attacked by a Kashik. What exactly happened here? Those skies are what happened. Not long after they fell dark, we had our first visit. There were hundreds of them. Tried to storm the hill. Only a handful made it up here, but that was more than enough. The rest are still down there now. And while we have a few willing fighters holding them back, they're sorely outnumbered. What do you think, Clive? That we join the fight. I thought you'd never offer. Now, where I need you is the Fallen Gate. That's where the fighting is fiercest. Hmm. Let the men know you've come to help. Something tells me they'll be pleased to see you. We're on our way. Crazy shit going down. Do you think there were as many as Martha says? <laughs> More. Just want to see what the hell's going on down here. You don't think they've abandoned us, do you? Them not. Not a chance. Ambrosia won't help me here. Whoa. We're having to, like, defend the area. The barricades we've set up around the town won't hold the Akashic back for long. Might buy us a few moments to say our last farewells, though. Shit. So no one even goes outside anymore? Is that bad out here? Oh, I see some weird shit walking around now.
Clive, wounded. We deal with the Akashic first. Crazy dog. Damn it. Okay, I gotta kill these puppies. I need a chance to attack my new sub. Pretty much the same as the regular enemies, but they have a different color. These men don't have the look of hired swords. If you've come to rob this place... You are mistaken, my Lord Rosfield. We're here by Madame Martha's leave. How do you know my name? Forgive me, my lord. There wasn't time for introductions. We're with the Guardians of the Flame. Wademen? But how did you come to be here? Where is your commander? Sir so Wade left earlier with a scouting party to find out where the Akashic were coming from. Did he? Take your wounded back to the inn. Martha will see you're looked after. We'll join you when on. Oh shit. Gotta find out what the hell happened to Wade. Sir Wade. Oh god, no. And to think you took them for thieves. A fine reward for holding off the horde, that is. When did Wade and his men arrive? Not long after Rosalith fell. The Guardians asked me to shelter some of them that had lost their homes. They were making ready to leave just as the skies turned, and we agreed it was best we stuck together. Mother! Trouble! The scouting party's almost at the lift, but they got a pack of Akashic snapping at their heels! And they got wounded with them! They're not gonna make it! Damn it all! We'll worry about them, Martha. You look after everyone here. If any can still fight, send them to the lift. I will. You two be safe now. Better start sticking these abilities on before it gets too late. Uh, what do we replace? Uh... Let's replace Garuda. Yeah, let's do it. Garuda with some crazy stuff. And, uh, Flare Breath. Wings of Light. I want to try this one. This seems fun. Satellite. Seems pretty good. Some multiple light speed familiars that attack any enemy which Clive uses magic. Huh. Seems good. I'll do Impulse and Satellite. Try it. Oh, that's your base ability. Gotcha. Gotcha.
Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll try to buy the ult at some point. I'm not that far away from getting it. Yeah, you can probably direct it as well. Giga Flare. And I'll, you know, lay waste to some poor creature with it. <laughs> <laughs>